Hi, I'm Dr. Edgar Campos from Mexicali Bariatric Center. Uh, today I'm going to talk about one of the questions that we get very, very often. Uh, does revisional surgery work or why revisional surgery work? Well, basically, first of all, if you're going to have a revisional surgery, we need to uh, think about what we're doing. You already have a weight loss surgery. And either we have two different options, why do you want to re revise your weight loss surgery? The first one is because your weight loss surgery failed. And that means that you didn't lose uh, more than 25 of the percent of the excess weight loss. Or you regain weight after your ba basically first surgery. So most of the cases, uh, fortunately, are here on this section where you already have a weight loss surgery and you're failing with the weight loss surgery or you're regaining weight with that weight loss surgery. But the other side, it's you already have a weight loss surgery and you're struggling with your surgery. Either you're having problems like reflux, either you have any complications with your surgery like a slip band or you have an eroded band or either you have malabsorption, too much malabsorption, and you're having nutritional deficiencies. So when we have two different weights, we need to approach each case different. If the revisional surgery needs to be done because the weight loss is not sufficient, then we need to address what kind of surgery do you have, and then we need to address all the clinical issues with your surgery so we can make the proper decision. So, if we have a gastric banding that is a restrictive surgery and you're not losing enough weight, and basically you're not having any trouble with your surgery, we can revise your gastric banding to another restrictive procedure as a gastric sleeve. So the quality on your life and your, uh, your expectation of the weight loss will get better. But if for any reason you're having problems like acid reflux or any other complications with your gastric banding, then we need to do the case very individualized so we can take the proper decision. And in that case, probably we can go a little bit further with the gastric bypass or convert the gastric banding to a duodenal switch. Until right now, we don't have a perfect surgery. We just have good surgeries with good patients and each patient is very different to, uh, to the others. So we need to do every proper case and make the surgery that works for each patient. Unfortunately, there's so many factors that we do not can take care of during surgery and that basically you'll return back home, you will retrain to eat yourself, you will retrain to, to follow your diet, you will rechange your life, but if for any reason the primary surgery is not working properly or in that case that primary surgery was too big or you need more malabsorption, then we need to decide what's, what's the next step. Either the surgery failed, but I think it's very important to, to make the right choice at the very beginning. But if for any reason you didn't have the right choice on the very beginning, then we have another option. On our center, more than 35% of the surgery that we do on the ba ba daily basis is revisional surgery. We convert band to gastric sleeve, we do gastric sleep to do a dental switch. We do gastric sleep to bypass. At the very beginning at Mexicali Bariatric Center, we used to implant bands over gastric bypass. So revisional surgery is not something new. It's something that has been for over 20 years. In our center, we have more than 18 years of experience with revisional surgery. But the main question is, it works? Yes, it works, definitely but it works different than the primary surgery. And this is quite important. If you have 100 pounds of excess weight loss and then you have a gastric sleeve and you lose 70 pounds and regain 20, probably you will be 50% of your excess weight loss. So then basically that will be the 100% of your success with the surgery, with the new surgery. So the first thing, your metabolism will be different. Your body already lose weight your metabolism slower down. It's not the same thing that you have a virgin surgery and your metabolism is burning calories all day because you already have more fat than when you begin losing weight and then you stall or regain some weight.
eat smaller meals, exercise, help to work with your surgery. We have seen the cases where before the revisional surgery they try to lose weight and they succeed, they will have a better outcome on their revisional surgery. But it's something that we need to recall very important. The weight loss rate is not that fast with a revisional surgery. On the other hand, if you're having a revisional surgery because you're having issues with your surgery, with your primary surgery, that means probably you can have a gastric banding that is very, very tight and you're throwing up all the time and you have malnutrition and you want that band to take it out. And then we convert to a gastric sleep and your BMI is very low. Probably in that case, the good thing or the very good result will be to gain some weight, but you will gain weight from good stuff like protein and you'll get more muscle and you'll get more good quality on your healthy life. So revisional surgery is working. Either it's not working to make you lose more weight because you already lose the weight that you need, but it's working to give you a better, better and healthier life. So I think revisional surgery, most of the time, 90 or 99% of the cases will work, but depends on what do you want for your weight loss surgery or your revisional surgery. That means that if you want to have a surgery to ease the reflux and we convert a gastric banding to a gastric sleep, probably the reflux will be the same or probably it can get worse. So the decision to convert the surgery because of acid reflux will be a, gy a gastric bypass and then you will have a better outcome and it will work. But if you want to lose weight, the gastric bypass will make you lose weight and you will have malabsorption. But then if you want to have a lot of protein and skip the vitamin deficiency, probably with the bypass you will need to be very square. So every new surgery that you will get to com the conversion to needs to be different approach, especially not only on the surgery, on the outcome, on the follow-up. So you will need to retrain to have a new surgery. I have seen so many cases when they think that the gastric banding will have the same effect and it will give them the same sensations with the gastric bypass or with the gastric banding or with the gastric sleep. Don't expect that. Every new surgery will have different sensations, will have different approach, you'll be able to eat different, and the result will be different. Especially on the weight loss, it's not that fast, so don't expect a very, very fast weight loss, but do expect a long-term weight loss with a revisional surgery. Do expect a better outcome on symptoms, and you'll have a very good surgery. So remember, every case is different, learn about your case, don't skip any information. The clinical history is quite important. It's not only about weight loss. It's about all the symptoms. If you're diabetic, if you have high blood pressure, if you have uh, acid reflux, even the intestinal movements, how do you feel, your bowel, every, every little detail counts. So that's very important for us. Thank you.